The flu outbreak has the Miami Valley Health Department struggling tonight to meet the demand for shots. Cavante Smalls takes us to one of the hardest hit, Greene County. Flu vaccines are a hot commodity throughout the Miami Valley. and some places, they're running low. and others, they're running out altogether. The Greene County Health Department has seen countless people and received numerous phone calls from people desperately seeking flu shots, which are in limited supply, to say the least. But the supplies are very, very limited, and we do anticipate that we, we will be out of vaccine by the end of the day. It's Amy Schmidt has been at the helm of Greene County's efforts to combat the flu. She says the number of flu cases is up compared to last year. We didn't have any hospitalized cases a year ago. This year, we had eight individuals who had to be hospitalized as a result of influenza. And Ronnie Acton and his grandson Owen came to the health department hoping to get flu shots. But the limited supply meant only Owen lucked out to get vaccinated because all adult vaccines were gone. We were told uh, we got here too late for the adults. I guess they run out sometime early this morning for the adults. But, you know, it's important to get the kids their shots. Like Greene County, Miami County also expects to run out of flu vaccines by day's end, and Clark County ran out completely on Monday and doesn't expect any more vaccines until tomorrow. People of all ages in Greene County tried their best to get a shot while they still could. I wanted to get a flu shot because I didn't want to get sick because I know the flu has been really bad and people have been dying from it. Those fears are what's expected to keep health departments busy for the next few weeks. Reporting in Xenia, Cavante Smallis, Fox 45 News. If you want a flu shot and it's really important for kids and seniors, best to call ahead. Make sure they're available from your local health department, doctor or pharmacist. Montgomery County's health department still has vaccine, even though health officials have not seen the lower number of flu cases they were hoping for this past week. Three weeks ago, there were more than 200 reported cases in Montgomery County. Two weeks ago, 121. But last week, it shot back up to 139 cases. And while 16 people were hospitalized from the flu in Montgomery County two weeks ago, last week, the number was still an unlucky 13 patients. You can find out much more about the flu on our website, learn about symptoms, track flu cases in your neighborhood, even get updates through email. Just go to fox45now.com and look for the flu outbreak tab. It's under Hot Topics.